What's up guys, uh, in today's video I'm going to show you how to check your BIOS version on your uh, laptop or your uh, desktop. You may want to do this for a number of reasons. First, you might have, have noticed that there is a latest BIOS version on the manufacturer's website. You may want to download that. That's possibly going to fix uh, quite a few issues. They would have mentioned what sort of issues are um, applied within that BIOS update. Uh, you might have experienced some sort of uh, issues when you were booting up the PC where it was freezing, uh, it was lagging, it wasn't booting up uh, expectedly as it was supposed to. Uh, so let's get into it. I'll show you guys on how to find this on your Windows uh, 8, uh, Windows 8.1 and Windows 7. Uh, simply click on the uh, window symbol here at the bottom. You'll be presented with this screen. Click on search and then type in run hit enter it will come uh, it will come down here at the bottom of the screen and uh, in here you need to type in ms info 32 so that is ms info 32 and then click ok uh, once you click that click on system summary and in here locate your bias version so here's the uh, bias version for my pc and to determine which version this is it it's after the um, the make of the, uh, the the model of the laptop itself. So mine is G seven fifty J Z dot two zero eight. So the bias version is two o eight. That that's 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 the uh, bias version. And you can see it was last updated on the seventeenth of seven twenty fourteen. Uh, now when I went over to my uh, manufacturer's uh, website, I was able to see that they had an updated version of this, uh, which was released on the thirtieth of of January twenty fifteen, and. Um, it fixes NVIDIA mods tool uh, test failed, which which was an issue in the previous version here, uh, 208. Um, but this also fixed some, some di different issues, uh, which was FN plus F8 on the uh, Windows 7. I'm using Windows 8 now, so this is already fixed. I just need to apply this to get my NVIDIA mods tools uh, working fine. Um, so like I said, I mean, it's always worthwhile checking uh, your manufacturer's website to make sure that if there is a bias update and uh, that you may want to consider updating this. Now there's also risks involved when you're trying to update your BIOS and you need to be uh, quite aware of that. So I mean BIOS is something you shouldn't really be getting involved with unless you have some sort of experience uh, or if you're for certain that the computer, the issues you're experiencing with the computer is related to BIOS. Um, because if, if the power cuts off or if the update wasn't successful uh, or say you rebooted the PC by accident or you force shut it down, it, it froze, any of these things that happen, uh, you, uh, you're you liable to uh, breaking your PC. By breaking, I mean you will not be uh, able to get it back to work. It will never boot back up. Um, basically, brick, brick means that it will be breaking computer terms. Breaking PC means that, that you would have just completely killed the PC. The BIOS is... Uh, basic input and output system, uh, which is the uh, program the, the computer's processor uh, uses to get the computer started after you turn it on. So as soon as you hit that button, uh, they work uh, together simultaneously uh, to get the computer up and running. They check for everything to make sure that all the hardware and software um, is working correctly. So, I mean, if you did fail to update that correctly, um, and you are liable to uh, breaking your PC. Uh, I'm not responsible for that. This is totally up to you. I'm just showing you guys on how to find the bias version before updating it so you're 100% that there, the, it is not up to date and that you may wish to apply the latest uh, update, which in my case is 2.10, uh, as I'm currently on 2.08. Um, and that's it there, guys. Uh, that's, that's how you do it. Uh, if you have any questions, leave a comment down below. Um, in the comment section um, and I'll try my best to get back to you guys as soon as possible uh, if you've enjoyed this video please do make sure to like subscribe and also share the video if possible uh, until next time peace